dishwashing ritual. I'm uh, Paul. <laughs> I was just thinking the other day that I don't think I've ever said my name on here. Um, so sorry, I didn't mean to be rude or anything. Just uh, I never thought of like introducing myself. But I'm Paul, uh, Mr. Brandon 21-ish, uh, which by the way doesn't mean anything. <laughs> my name's not Mr. Brandon. Um, I just, uh, when I was creating an account, I tried to think of something to put in there and I put Mr. Brandon 21-ish, so there's no deeper meaning. Actually, I guess I suppose 21, that's my favorite number. Uh, 21 has some meaning. Uh, uh, it's not a lucky number or something, I just like the number actually because of baseball. So if you know my favorite team, maybe you'll be able to figure out why 21 is my favorite number. Uh, so uh, if you can guess, you can leave that in the comments. <laughs> Uh, although it's it's not like it used to be, let's say that. That's another hint. <laughs> but uh, 21, yeah, that's always my number that I choose for different things. So uh, I was gonna, uh, I'll look here, I guess, instead of looking out the window. Um, the last couple of videos I've done with dishwashing, I've gotten going on these topics that are kind of pretty serious and stuff. So I wanted to keep this one a lot lighter. And I was planning on doing one today on Sunday, but uh, of course then yesterday in Poland there was a big uh, tragedy and I don't know, I, I guess I'll talk about that a little bit. Uh, so uh, it might not be the lightest uh, <laughs> dishwashing ritual, but I'll get into that in a second here. First of all, uh, the dishes. And today is a massive dishwashing day. As you can see, whew, just what you've been waiting for. Look at that. Popcorn was in there. Lots of dishes in the sink. I have dishes over here. <laughs> so I have a lot of different things to try to try to wash up here. Uh, the last couple of days, yesterday I wasn't able to wash. And then Friday I worked from 8 to 7.30. So I didn't feel like washing when I got home at 8 o'clock at night. And uh, I think even Thursday, I can't remember if I washed or not on Thursday. It might have been just a few, I think I washed really good on Wednesday and then Thursday there was just a few dishes so I thought oh I'll just leave it to the next day and then of course I, you know, I forgot that I, you know, the next day I was working like the whole time so that's why we have the big dishwashing but that's why we have the dishwashing ritual to turn on some music, turn on the water and wash some dishes. Um, hmm. I think I'll put the water over here. There, put some soap in, and I'll do the ritual type stuff, and I'll get back to you in a second. Alright, so as you can see, it took a while. I'm on track number seven here, so it took a while to get those dishes done, but uh, it's a good feeling. Now I just have to dry them up and they'll be ready to go. So like I said, uh, you probably heard yesterday there was a plane crash in uh, Western Russia with the Polish president was on the plane and his wife and a bunch of other leaders in the country and they all died on that plane. So it was you know, a shocking day in Poland. Uh, I was going to the school yesterday because we had our 20th anniversary celebration for the start of our school and uh, I got there and I saw all the people kind of gathered around a radio in the reception area I was like what are they you know that's weird why they listen to that and I walked in and one of my students came up and said did you hear what happened and you know it's a Polish president is dead and at that point it had just happened so it, you know there wasn't a lot of information like how or what happened or whatever but uh, you know, everybody's kind of in shock and, you know, we went through with some of the different things uh, for the celebration that day, but it was all kind of, you know, uh, 
weird and downtoned and everything. So, I mean, it really just shocking because it wasn't just the president. It, you know, the president was on the plane, his wife, uh, the head of the defense ministry in Poland, the head of the, or the chief of staff of the army, other leading generals in the army and navy, uh, the head of the central bank in Poland, a bunch of important officials in the government, uh, several members of parliament, uh, a former president of Poland was on the plane, uh, a bunch of bishops and uh, important churchmen were on the plane, so it was just, wow, you know, uh, you know, it's not just in Poland, but I mean, that's never happened in, in the world, you know, where such uh, a huge amount of important people in the country died, you know, in one plane crash or accident like that so you know all of yesterday was just everybody kind of trying to absorb it and and now uh, they announced yesterday that Poland's going to have a week of mourning for the rest for the whole week and uh, you know the flags are at half staff and everything and there's special ceremonies going on so it's just a really and to add to it you know they were going to Russia to commemorate the 70th anniversary of Katyn, which uh, happened during World War II, uh, which was one of the big disasters in Polish history. Uh, 22,000 Poles were executed, uh, murdered by the Soviet Union uh, at, at the beginning of the war, in 1940. And so, you know, that's been a big sore spot between Russia and Poland all the way up till today, you know, because of course Russia's uh, for many, many years denied that they were responsible for it. They blamed it on the Germans. But, you know, most of the rest of the world knew <laughs> who was really responsible. And recently now the Russians have started to um, admit, you know, responsibility and stuff. So it's been easing up on relations between Poland and Russia. So it was a big moment. And then, you know, now another group of leaders, because those 22,000 Poles, a lot of them were important officers and intellectuals and potential leaders of Poland in that era, you know, so of the Second Republic of Poland. And now the Third Republic of Poland, their leadership is, you know, going through a very big uh, transition, obviously, today. And, you know, the head of parliament took over the duties of the president. I mean, fortunately in Poland, the, the main day-to-day -day operations of government is run by the prime minister. So, uh, you know, things are going to go on and stuff. But, uh, you know, the president does have some important duties here, and so now the head of parliament will be doing that, and I guess in a couple months they're going to have another election now to try to to try to, to elect a new president. And, and Kaczynski, I mean, the president is uh, Lech Kaczynski, and, uh, he, you know, he's also an important historical figure in Poland. I mean, him and his brother, he has a twin brother, they started out as child actors. And so even today you can watch, not today maybe, but, you know, just a little while ago I was watching one of their movies, you know, when they were little boys uh, acting in these, you know, kind of children movies and stuff. And, and then when they grew older they got involved in politics. Uh, Kaczynski was uh, one of the leaders in the Solidarity Movement, which was responsible for helping bring down communism in Eastern Europe, you know. Um, so he's a historical figure and now, and the president and... You know, a lot of people didn't like him in Poland either, politically, but obviously he's, um, you know, it's a, it's a tragedy to lose him. And uh, his, in fact, when he first became president, his twin brother uh, was appointed as prime minister. So he had twin brothers as president and prime minister in Poland for a couple of years, which was interesting. <laughs> and they look exactly alike. You know, I can't tell the difference between the two guys. Um, but uh, now there's only one of them, so... Anyway, I, I promise next time when I do the dishwashing ritual that I'll keep it a lot lighter. Uh, I had some ideas to talk about some different things that were not quite so serious, but it's a vlog and you know, I'm not apologizing. I'll talk whatever I want to talk about and you can watch if you want, <laughs> but uh, I'm just talk about what I think about when I'm washing dishes and of course it's hard not to think about that today. So I'll get to drying the dishes. All right, I don't really have anything to add here. I'll just uh, show you the, the clean area. <laughs> the kitchen is clean now. No more dishes. And uh, everything's set to go. So, I guess I'll just sign off. 
<laughs> sign off. I don't know. But uh, I wish you guys a great day, wherever you are or whatever you're doing. Uh, enjoy it. Have fun. And uh, talk to you later.